now we're going to talk about light therapy. And this is Elizabeth, and she's going to help me. Hi. This is an 8,000 milliwatt uh, light therapy device. It's visible red and infrared, so it means it takes care of superficial and deep problems. With 8,000 milliwatts, it's extremely quick and takes very little time. It can reduce swelling. It can make people feel better, but it's really stunning how it actually helps things heal much more rapidly or helps things heal that couldn't heal without light therapy. We're going to turn this on. You can see it's extremely bright. Generally, you wouldn't want to use it more than one minute on a spot. And it's got a one minute timer, so you put it on the spot and leave it there for a minute. The longer you leave it on a spot, the deeper it will go. If it's more of a skin problem, then you would paint. If you're static, it's going to penetrate more deeply because more photons go into the area. What the photons do is they stimulate the mitochondria and help the cell cells heal. So one wonderful thing is to treat TMJ pain and facial pain and head pain. So if we turn this on, we can put it right on the TMJ, and that will help the joint and all of the muscles. Of course, you can treat muscles of the forehead and face, if you go to my book, LED and Light Therapy, you'll see that there's information on what they're doing at Harvard and uh, Mass General Hospital about treating the brain. And if someone has scar tissue, what you're going to do is you're going to put the light on the area first to soften it up. Then you can do deep tissue work on the scar tissue and break it up and then put some more light therapy on there to help the area heal and become healthy tissue. So one wonderful thing about the UltraBuy is it's got a 60 second timer so you don't have to think because you rarely ever need to use it more than 60 seconds. You want to actually always have skin to skin contact because material tape will actually block the emission from penetrating into the tissues. Laser has been found and light has been found to stimulate proliferation of cells. So generally we say avoid all cancers, any kind of skin cancer. However, in medical centers and oncology clinics around the world, they're using light and laser therapy after someone's had chemotherapy or radiation because they find that the side effects of radiation can be mitigated with light and laser therapy. So let's say you're treating the lower back. If you want to treat the sacroiliac joints, boy, is that easy. Just put it on the air and you can leave it. 30 seconds usually does it. Occasionally you want to go up to a minute, but with a powerful LED like this, 30 to 60 seconds is all you need. Now, if you want to treat the lower back, you might just put it on the low back for 30 seconds. If it's a disc, though, and it's very deep, of course, you probably leave it on there for a minute. If you want to get a wider arrow, you put it on transversely like this, and then you turn it vertically and leave it that way. The beauty is you can actually put this on the body and then work on some other part of the patient and then come back and it will treat by itself. So it's almost like treating without any hands. There's the middle back. That's how you treat the middle back. If it's off the side like the rhomboids or those muscles, you can just move it off the side. And you can just leave it there. That's the beauty of it. You can just put it on the area that needs to be treated, leave it there for 30 to 60 seconds. And if you want to treat the upper back, there you go. Treat the upper back.